So we're up early today, it's uh, half past seven, and we have a very starey cat that you can hopefully see lodged under there. But we're now off yet another staggeringly beautiful day to the town, half seven. We're going to go up to the clock tower, or church tower, or bell tower, whatever it is, and uh, then go and have a breakfast, fry up and meet Catherine's sister and brother-in-law, Fiona and Dean. But look at this again, what a lovely day here in Skiathos, 7.30. Here we are early morning in Skiathos, not many people about, but a few actually. It's now about quarter to eight. Most people are still slumbering in their pit. You can see all the higher scooters, quads and so on. All neatly positioned, look, that'd be good if you've got OCD, people would like that. And the higher boat's getting ready to go out if they've got a charter. And there's the two women deciding who's going to have the brain cell today. Probably Catherine, I'm not sure. Fiona, whose turn is it for the brain cell? Sharing it today, excellent. the steps if you're gonna do this do it early in the morning because in the middle of the day this is a heck of a well it's not a heck of a climb but it is if it's hot we've got a doo doo following us that beautiful bougainvillea and this blue one don't know what that one is rather pretty though Yep, Bougainvillea everywhere, and I think it's almost the leaf. Now it is the flower. Now that's not a Bougainvillea. This is something else. <laughs> what are they looking for? Oh, what? So, we're approaching what is called the final step, which clearly isn't the final step, because there are more steps. And when you're a fat bloke, like Catherine, it's hard getting up these steps. Oh, and here we are. Different way this time. Leave the water alone. So, we've made it. There's the clock or bell tower. Light's still on. Of course, it does make your heat hot. So we have the very posh yacht 
in the dock. This is Gethos Town. Right, that's breakfast. <laughs> well, some dongers are going off from the church in the distance. It must be eight o'clock. That'll get you up. Get out of bed, you lazy buggers. down I feel and this is the wrong height isn't it Dee? You know what they've done? I bet you they've set that before these were on it. I bet they've set the height for that when they were concrete then they've bedded these on. Barking up on the roof. Well it's cooler here isn't it? So we're heading out afresh for the big old fry up which curiously contains cucumber. Not fried, I has no egg. That's the ferry, isn't it? That is the ferry. Yeah. Twelve guests you fit on that. That's it. It's that. Yeah, that's the is it inside that bit? And here, and here coming in we have a pretty little Boat, all colour coordinated, and her door says it matches her now. But show you from that, put your nail varnish in the picture, Catherine. Look, it matches her nail varnish, so she ought to buy that. Here comes the uh, cruise boat in, we think, from the mainland, and what is it playing? That will cause me a copyright claim. Now when we were, when we were in Bortzi, which is a little outcrop, oh lovely, there's a restaurant up here that we don't really like, it's a bit posh. But um, yeah, lots of people went here and there was a place you can go down and have a little swim. Which I might do even though I haven't got a towel. A little porpoise out there. No, oh, actually a little starfish. Well, big starfish actually. The side of Bortzi as you walk round and now indoors. Wanted to go to the Tarlet and she's found on there. So we're timing her. Here she is. And judging by the time, Catherine, we timed you. We timed you, Catherine. She's taking no notice. She definitely had a toozy.